All right. All right. So I'm gonna be. I'm behind this customer. This person right here. I'm gonna hit the cruise control button. Hit set. I'm set at 48 miles per hour. I'm gonna increase that to say 60. But I'm not gonna go 60 because the car is in front of me. I have one bar between me and that car in front of us that indicates I am 1.5 seconds behind that car. I am not touching the brake or the gas. And he's really doing some good acceleration before he comes to a stop. I'm not applying the brakes right now. This is the adaptive cruise control. I'm not touching the brake or the gas. The car is coming to a stop. And this is just to indicate and show you the limitations of the adaptive cruise control. All right, not the brake assist. It came to a complete stop. I have not touched the brake or the gas. All right, now that's cruise control off or on. Let's say, for example, we were still following that car and another car cut us off while we we're in adaptive cruise control. My legacy or Outback or whatever has the eyesight will slow down and that's going to be your new target. I have it set at 60 miles per hour. If say, for example, we're driving 55. He accelerates to 70. I will stay at 60. I will not go past that unless I adjust that speed. If he goes off an off-ramp and there's no other cars in front of us, it's just regular cruise control. Um, for the brake assist, something completely different from the cruise control, but same system as far as the eyesight. Subaru tested a 20 mile per hour difference. For example, you're going towards a, a wall at 20 miles per hour. You take your foot off the brake and the gas. It will slam on the brakes. Actually, it will apply the brakes softly, give you a warning beep then slam on the brakes and give you a louder warning beep and it will come to a stop before hitting that object. Insurance Institute of Highway Safety tested it at a 30 mile per hour difference. We were actually the only manufacturer able to stop at 30 miles per hour. I got, I used, I had, I've got to try this personally myself. It wasn't at a brick wall though. <laughs> it was at a, a inflatable outback. The system works great. It is not meant to avoid all accidents, but it will help prevent some. Um, if you'd like to come in, I'd be happy to show you the system. You can reach me on my cell phone at 678-447-2366. And again, this is Lance Wilhite with Super of Gwinnett on my how-to video of the eyesight function.